Salmari Establiso from ESN 2B and I am your student nurse for today. Perineal care involves washing the genital and rectal areas of the body. It should be done at least once a day during bed bath, shower or tub bath. It is done more often when a patient is incontinent. This prevents infection, odors, and irritation. The first thing to do is perform hand washing. Next is to knock on the door of the patient, check the bed, and provide privacy. Introduce yourself to the patient, explain the procedure, and have consent. This reduces anxiety and enhances cooperation. Hi ma'am, I am Giselle Tabliso, your student nurse for today. Can I perform perennial care? Thank you ma'am. Next is to gather all the equipments needed, which are six washcloth, water basin, soap, waterproof barrier, and gloves. Allow the patient to check the temperature of the water. Next is to perform hand washing and put on gloves. This reduces the possible spread of infection. Put the waterproof barrier. Raise the gown up to the hips and the cover on the knees. Or you can also do this technique. Wet the first washcloth, rinse it out, and put soap. Wipe the side with the first corner of the washcloth. Then fold it out and wipe the other side. Fold it out again and wipe the middle with the last corner. So you're going to rinse it out with the same manner. Now, wet the second washcloth. Wipe the side with the first corner, then fold it out, and wipe the other side with the other corner. And last, wipe the middle with the last corner of the washcloth. Now, just repeat the steps with a dry washcloth. Put the patient on her side. So the same procedure, wet the washcloth and put soap, wipe up each side and in the middle. In rinsing, same procedure, wet the washcloth, wipe up both sides and in the middle with a wet washcloth. In drying, just repeat the steps with a dry washcloth. Remove the waterproof barrier. Lastly, discard the used water, put the washcloth, the dirty clothes hamper, take off gloves in a proper way, wash hands, unprovide privacy, and address the patient if she has concern. And that is how you perform perennial flushing. Thank you!